Ever want to own your very own space shuttle? Well, very soon you can. With the program winding down later this year, NASA is looking to sell the three remaining orbiters. Back in 2008, NASA was expecting potential buyers to have to pay around 42 million US dollars to have an orbiter saved, prepped for display, and shipped to a US airport. Want some space shuttle main engines to go with your orbiter? Add an additional $400,000 to $800,000 each. Now, if that's out of your budget, fret not, NASA's having a fire sale. Recently, NASA's revised its price estimates. Rather than $42 million, you can now get an orbiter for a mere $28.8 million. Those engines are now free with purchase, but you have to call within the next 60 minutes. Operators are standing by. Now, why the big price reduction? According to NASA, they've updated the requirements needed to save the vehicle. Each orbiter has hazardous chemicals on board, and NASA needs to cleanse the vehicle before they give it to a museum, which will potentially have children near it, or hopefully, if we're lucky, allowing people to walk in it. Since it won't cost as much to save the vehicle as originally thought, those savings are passed right on to you. So why then are the space shuttle main engines free? Well, no one really expressed any interest in them, although that free does come with a cost. You have to both pay for shipping and install them yourself. I don't think your local auto mechanic has the parts required to install a shuttle engine. Smithsonian is currently on deck to get Discovery, or OV-103, probably the most clunky of the three remaining orbiters. Atlantis, by far the most powerful orbiter, and the most famous one used in missions of high importance, has yet to be claimed. No one really cares about Endeavor. Don't agree that Atlantis is the best orbiter? Let your voice be heard. Comment below, or better yet, join us this Thursday at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern for our live show. We'll have Douglas from Parabolic Arc on to talk human spaceflight, and we'll get his opinion on which orbiter is best. For those of you not in the United States, the show is this Friday, 2 a.m. Coordinated Universal Time. And just for Carrie Ann, because it's her birthday, and I'm doing this on her birthday, because she has to work on her birthday, as her present to you, all the orbiters are the same. <laughs>